A Green Bay man is learning what it's like to have his left arm back after seven years of living without it. New with Tim Katie Anderson shows us how technology is giving one amputee full range once again. I can't think of nothing better than an arm. Nicholas Kelly lost his left arm seven years ago after a nearly fatal crash into pier. I lost control of my moped um, somehow and ended up striking a steel pole. If it wasn't for me wearing a motocross helmet, uh, I probably wouldn't be here. He was in a coma for about a month with a broken jaw, a fractured skull, and a paralyzed arm that was eventually amputated. It was a benefit to have it cut off, but only because it would have got caught on things or it could have caused a worse health situation for me. Now he's getting a new prosthetic arm loaded with advanced technology that allows him to control it with his mind. It's basically converting the signals from your brain and when you're thinking about opening, closing the hand and moving the elbow, so it's translating that signal to actually making it work. <laughs> Kelly has been working to get the arm for the last four years. Now that it's a reality, he's looking forward to his new normal and doing activities he enjoys. I plan on going fishing and holding a fishing pole and reeling it in. I, like, and that's, that, what am I, I, I can't even think. I, I will use it every day. I mean, it will be like the shirt I put on. In Green Bay, Katie Anderson, Action 2 News.